I heard thee say even now, thou likes not that when Cassio left my wife. What didst not like? And when I told thee he was of my counsel in my whole course of wooing, thou criedst, indeed? If thou dost love me, show me thy thoughts. My lord, you know I love you. I think thou dost. <laughs> And for I know thou art full of love and honesty, and weighest thy words before thou givest them breath. Therefore, these stops of thine fright me the more. For Michael Cassio, I dare be sworn, I think that he is honest. I think so too. Men should be what they seem. Yet there's more in this. I prithee, speak to me as to thy thinkings, as thou dost ruminate, and give thy worst of thoughts the worst of words. Utter my thoughts? Thou dost conspire against thy friend, Iago, if thou but thinkst him wronged, and makest his ear a stranger to thy thoughts. I beg of you. It were not for your quiet, nor your good, nor my manhood, honesty, and wisdom to let you know my thoughts. What dost thou mean? Good name in man and woman, dear my lord, is the immediate jewel of their souls. Who steals my purse? Steals trash? Well, tis something, nothing, was mine. Tis his, and has been slave to thousands. But he who filches from me my good name, robs me of that which not enriches him and makes me poor indeed. By heaven, I will know thy thoughts. You cannot! If my heart were in your hand, nor shall not, whilst tis in my custody. Ah! <coughs> oh, beware, my lord, of jealousy. It is the green-eyed monster that doth mock the meat it feeds on. <laughs> <laughs>